Sagittarius, that spirit is about to send you a higher level soulmate, okay? Because the work has to be done. The work has to be done. Time can't be wasted. We can't keep wasting time. And this individual has just wasted time after time, okay? They just are not applying the lessons. They're still, you know, the South Node is there. They're still in their karmic energy. But you see the Four of Pentacles. They're refusing to let you go, okay? The High Priestess, they're communicating with you through telepathy, right? The Six of Cups. But it's like, this isn't doing anything. This isn't going to move things forward, okay? The King of Wands, this individual is not ready for a commitment, okay? They're very sexual, okay? Very lustful. They might be doing sex magic here to keep you trapped in your head. You have the Eight of Swords. So yeah, of Wands, for some of you, this individual may have gone with someone else. It felt more easier, it felt more comfortable, but they're not in, their, their heart is not with that person. Their heart is not with that person. Their heart is with you, okay? You're their center, the center of their heart, Sagittarius, okay? I do see that here. This person is very much in love with you, and this individual is really feeling, okay, the loss, the loss of your presence in their life, okay? They feel very much left out in the cold. You see these, yeah, you guys are psychics, a lot of you, okay? You're very connected, mind, body, and soul, okay? And a lot of people see your energy. They see you as this radiant being, okay? Your energy is very, very strong, very powerful, Hello, my beautiful Sagittarians. How are you? Welcome back to the channel. Starcy Zayed here. If you're new, make sure to subscribe and join the Soul Tribe. We have a read for you guys, okay? This is who's headed your way, who's coming towards you. Just a general read, so take what resonates. Leave what doesn't behind. Crosswatchers, you are welcome. This message is also timeless. Personal reads are closed until further notice. And with all that out of the way, we're going to get started, my beautiful Sagittarians. Let's see. Who's headed your way? Okay. Oof. Okay, so we do have the South Node, we have Tauros, and then we have number six, which is the Lovers. You might be a life path number six, okay? We could see something something happening in on February 6th, or we could even see something happening six hours, six weeks, okay? The sixth month, take it how it resonates, but I do see here that, um, oh, it's a very strong energy, okay? Who's headed your way is someone that you have unfinished business with okay i know that. look i know you wanna <laughs> i have to call it how it is i just have to say sometimes you do have a karmic contract to fulfill with someone okay sometimes you are paired with a karmic okay and not all karmics are narcissists you know abusers not all of them are like that some of them they're a karmic because you have karma to clear with that person in this lifetime okay it's very important that you guys understand this you know just because you're with a karmic doesn't mean that it's going to be a toxic bad relationship okay it just means that you guys have some stuff that you have to clear out in this lifetime that you didn't clear out in the past lifetimes so i do see here some of you are dealing with that i also see here the person coming in um headed towards you right they want commitment with toro stare but it's like this individual this individual still has a lot of stuff that they're needing to heal, that they're needing to work on. Okay. The gift. Present. Honoring and offering. Yeah, you have a beautiful gift here. And it's time to share it with the world, okay? The hidden worlds. Changing consciousness, awareness, extrasensory perception. Yeah, you guys are psychics. A lot of you, okay? You're very connected mind body and soul okay and a lot of people see your energy they see you as this radiant being okay your energy is very very strong very powerful very beautiful yeah the liminal dance delicacy fragility transience and then returning home transition life between lifetimes loving welcome okay spirit is putting you on this path where you're about to be reunited with your soul family, your soul tribe, okay, with the people that are meant to be in your life. Um, but what I see here is that they want to pair you with this person, but it's like this individual is still not applying the lessons, okay? They're still not learning them. So we're going to see if anybody else is headed towards you. Thank you so much, angels, ancestors, spirit guides, universe, galactic beings, ancient ancestors, elders, guide us in this read for my beautiful Sagittarians. What messages do you have for them? Truly grateful for your divine guidance and celestial knowledge. One, two, three, 
four, five, six. Let's see what we have. We have the eight of swords. Yes, this is what I was saying. And you know what? Mm, here, let me draw the rest of the cards. We have the queen of cups, okay? I'm getting here the moon. Okay, I'm getting here that it is what I was saying. This individual was trying to keep you stuck, okay? They're still stuck in some not-so-good ways. They're not applying the lessons that they should have learned, okay? They're not applying these lessons, is what I'm saying here. And they're trying to keep you stuck. Ten of Cups. What else, Spirit? The Hermit. And the Five of Pentacles, okay? You walked away. You, you decided to, you know what... Finish this off with this individual, okay? The Knight of Cups. But I see here this individual is chasing after you because they feel alone. They feel very much left out in the cold, okay? They still... <clears throat> yeah, you see? You can't make it up. You're gonna have the King of Cups directly underneath, and you're the Queen of Cups. Okay, I might take this to the extended. I might take this to the extended because this is your divine counterpart. Even if the South Note is here... Just to know that you and this individual have a lot of karma that you need to clear in this lifetime. But what I also see is that this individual is not applying a lot of the lessons that they've learned, okay? Right now, you and this individual are in separation. And this individual is really feeling, okay, the loss. The loss of your presence in their life, okay? They feel very much left out in the cold. You see these two people. You can literally read the book here, okay? This is the tarot deck. Let me show you. That's a tarot deck, and you can even read the booklet for the Five of Pentacles. These people are wandering outside in a blizzard. That's literally what the book says, okay? And look, the hermit is out in the winter. This individual is going through a dark night of the soul because of how they treated you, okay? Because they were not applying the lessons learned, okay? They feel very helpless. They really need love, but they're not giving themselves the love that they know they deserve, okay? They're not loving themselves enough. Yeah, the Two of Swords is here, and the Queen of Wands. For some of you, this individual may have gone with someone else. It felt more easier, it felt more comfortable, but they're not in, their, their heart is not with that person. Their heart is not with that person. Their heart is with you, okay? You're their center, the center of their heart, Sagittarius, okay? I do see that here. This person is very much in love with you, okay? The moon talks about everything hidden. The moon literally talks about everything hidden, and... Deep down, this individual imagines you guys together, marry with kids, okay? Regardless of your situation, male, female, 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 male, male, okay? However you guys describe yourselves. This individual imagines being with you, living that life, okay? In your guys' house, okay? Being married, having kids, okay? Waking up in your arms, okay? Or to, you know, waking up and holding you in their arms, Okay, this is what this individual deep down, they 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 envision that. They also self-pleasure themselves to you a lot, okay? This individual has a hold on your energy, I do see here. You have a lot of deep love for this person, okay? If this isn't your story, don't try to fit it. Um, I see here you have a very, very deep love, okay? It's a very strong soul connection here between you and this person, Okay, and with Taurus there, it feels like Taurus is fixed sign energy, so it feels like things have been moving very, very slow, and not much progress has been made, okay? You could be dealing with a Scorpio. You might want to watch the Scorpio read as well. You could be dealing with a Cancer, a Pisces, um, Gemini, Virgo, or a Taurus. Here we have the Five of Swords, yeah. So there could have been an argument between the two of you. You have the Sun the ace of cups and the six of swords and you know there was an argument you just had to remove yourself here i feel like this person is acting like a child acting very immature okay they're not owning up to their feelings how they really feel towards you and you have no choice but to walk away or you're wanting to walk away right but this person is still holding on to your energy okay and it's like if as soon as you try to walk away this person is chasing after you yeah they don't want you to go with anyone else but i do see here i am getting the energy sagittarius as spirit is about to send you a higher level soulmate okay because the work has to be done the work has to be done time can't be wasted we can't keep wasting time and 
this individual has just wasted time after time, okay? They just are not applying the lessons. They're still, you know, the south node is there. They're still in their karmic energy. But you see the four of pentacles. They're refusing to let you go, okay? The high priestess, they're communicating with you through telepathy, right? The six of cups. But it's like, this isn't doing anything. This isn't going to move things forward, okay? The king of wands, this individual is not ready for a commitment, okay? They're very sexual, okay? Very lustful. They might be doing sex magic here to keep you trapped in your head. You have the eight of swords. So, yeah. They're trying to keep you trapped. They're trying to keep you from moving forward, okay? They don't want you to move forward because they love you. But they're not owning up to their feelings. That's the thing with this person, So I do see Spirit sending somebody new here with the Fool. <sighs> somebody that is going to be fast and take action, okay? They're not going to play these mind games that this Divine Masculine has been playing. This individual is very much determined to have you, this new person, this soulmate, okay? Yeah, Temperance. This person is also spiritual that's headed your way, okay? That's Sagittarius energy, that's your energy. And the Seven of Pentacles. You know what I also see? You're reaping what you sow. And you've done the work. You've done the healing. So now Spirit is going to send you these blessings. Yeah, death. There was an argument here. Queen of Cups, yeah. You see, there was an argument here. Between you and the King of Cups. Okay, you and your person. Your Divine Masculine. There was an argument. And you were like, I have to move away from this because the Knight of Pentacles, this individual is taking their sweet time. Okay, they're taking their sweet ass time. They're taking forever. Too much time. Yeah, they're being left out in the cold because they're taking forever. This is on them. The hangman. The hangman were just pausing and waiting. They're not doing anything. And eventually you just get frustrated. You're like, you know what? You know, a great person... And maybe you guys know about this person. They're another tarot reader. <laughs> but they said, you know, in a read for the Divine Masculine, they were like, they can do math, right? Nothing plus nothing equals nothing. And that's what I get from this individual. Okay, this Divine counterpart. <clears throat> this was supposed to be a beautiful, blessed connection. But as long as they do nothing, then nothing's going to move forward. And that's why Spirit is sending you someone else. Okay? They're sending you someone new. <clears throat> and you are really going to like this person, okay? But I do feel like the pain is still... I feel like the pain is always going to be there, Sagittarius. You're always going to have deep love for this individual. Yeah, Three of Wands. Like, you're always going to be watching from afar. Um, because you're Divine Feminine. You know, and that's your Divine Masculine. You love them. You love them unconditionally. But the hermit, you know that you have to turn your back on this. Because it's just... This individual is not applying the lessons, okay? You know you have to move forward with the chariot there. That there's nothing else you can do here. And spirit is pushing you forward, okay? Spirit is pushing you forward. Spirit is pushing you away from this. Spirit wants this person on their own right now, okay? This person needs to... This divine masculine needs to be on their own right now, okay? They have to go through this dark night of the soul stuff. Yeah, Ten of Cups. They need to realize here what they're losing. Yeah, Eight of Swords. They need to really sit hard and think. You know, it could even be that this person goes through a death. Okay, they go through a death rebirth. And they come back in as the soulmate that you've always wanted them to be. It could even be that. You know, that later down the line. You know, for those of you that do want this individual. Okay, this individual, you're at the center of their heart. The Five of Cups there. Um... You know, and they're very upset that you're walking away. Okay, it's a tower moment. It's a tower moment for them. They're very, very sad. Okay. They're spying in on you heavily. They want to know what you're doing, what you're up to. And they want to make sure that you're not with anyone else. But at the same time, they didn't really do much of anything to make this connection work, right? They were very slow, slow moving. I have to call it how I see it fluidity they were not willing to be flexible spirit wants you to be flexible right now sagittarius because they're about to offer you something brand new okay a rare opportunity is about to present itself to you and you can't sagittarius you can't be in your head and stuck in your head with this person 
okay? This person's trying to keep you trapped, try to keep you in the low vibration. And spirit wants to send you blessing. Yeah, look, marriage. This is how spirit sees you as his bride, okay? God sees you as his bride. Watch the Leo read. You're his bride, okay? And, y you know, he's not going to send you the bargain bin scraps. You know, somebody that's in the South knows, somebody that's not doing the work. That's still round and round we go. They're not doing it. They're not doing it with this person, you know? You have a lot of potential here. Spirit sees your potential. They know that you're ready for a commitment. Yeah, you see the unseen. This individual is not seeing clearly. They're refusing to acknowledge what is going on. Yeah, fragmented. The picture's incomplete. Having too many options. This person wanted to be a player. They wanted to be an F-boy. They wanted to be an F-boy. They wanted to be an F-girl. Like, that's what it was. Dreams. But they're trying to send you messages through dreams. They dream about you all the time, but that's not going to do anything. Here we have teamwork. So... Spirit is really wanting you to get a lot of work done. There's, there's a lot of work here that needs to be done. Okay, this individual is very angry at you right now for whatever reason. They feel left out in the cold. They definitely might have um, undiagnosed bipolar disorder, right? Because they're very wishy-washy. They're very back and forth. Um, but what I do see here is Spirit is pushing you away from this, okay? They don't want you, you know, don't message this person. Don't interact with them. Just leave them alone. Because spirit is working on this right now, okay? For some of you, this person will come back in the future, and you will have the choice. You know, you will have the choice to decide to take them back in. Um, but for now, just let them be, because they're going through the hangman, right? They're watching you, but they're also realizing a lot, okay? They're learning a lot. They're going through a dark night of the soul, okay? So they're still um, going through some healing loves. If you really love this person, you really want them back, remove yourself for now and give them their space okay for those of you that aren't interested in this person spirit is sending somebody else your way okay a high level soulmate the knight of swords that is ready for this commitment with you so that is your read i hope you enjoyed it i wish you the best of luck and i wish you luck